What's up, dear wonderful people? It's Oliver here, and today is a very belated uh, video that is a look back reflection uh, on 2017. So in a second, we're gonna have a montage of the best clips, my the best moments uh, from my videos from 2017. I know this video is relatively late, a couple weeks late, but who cares though, right? Still wanted to do it, so better late than never. But before I show you that, I just wanna tell you guys thank you so much for being a wonderful uh, Joy Boy community, uh, being just dearest wonderful people, and I'm so grateful that I embarked on this YouTube journey because I never thought it would result in all you folks watching me uh, and commenting and just building this community. I'm going to the Vlogger Roundtable group chat. I'm gonna try and get, get a hold of someone. Hey, Coco, what's up? I'm filming a video right now. Uh, uh, it's like a uh, look look back on 2017. Um, uh, what you learned from YouTube or the, your favorite moment from 2017 that has to do with YouTube or something something about YouTube and 2017 that is from your experience. So probably my favorite part of 2017 was meeting the entire YVR. You know, getting to know everyone. Uh, they're super awesome people, and uh, I'm so stoked to be on this team. Well, Coco, it's a j it's a joy to know your soul as well. Thank you, Coco. Yeah, no worries. Have a good one. Peace out, dude. See ya. Gotta love that dude. Gotta love that dude. So You're ready. We learned from this year. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right, all right. So the thing I learned most from 2017 is to trust the people you work with and give them give them all the work they d they deserve, but put a lot of um, a lot of trust in your collaborators that they will do the job that they are there to do. Nice. So, yeah. Love it, Max. That's 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 awesome. You know, if if I would pick one thing that really stood out to me, would be just the whole sense of community that is developed within everything. So not just uh, individually, not just you know growing an audience, mm -hmm. but like being able to connect with other people. Um, from around the world who are also creating similar things Love and share it. ideas. I think yeah. just the idea of having this community that we're not in it alone. Um, mm -hmm. We're here to work as a whole team and there's competition, but it's also we're helping each other out. We're not just trying yeah. to beat yeah. each other. That's and true. I love that, man. It's just so awesome. Yeah, me too. That, that's great. That, that, thank you, thank you guys for sharing for sharing your uh, reflection. I appreciate it. Okay, you ready? Yeah. All right. And action. So Ryan, in, in, um, from your point of view, what's the most important uh, thing that you learned from YouTube in 2017? I think the thing I learned most, not only from YouTube, but just from the whole year of 2017, is um, that if you set your mind to something and you want something a lot, you can accomplish really anything out there. I mean, in the beginning of the year, I had like, no idea how to make films or how to make movies, how to use a camera, and um, it was what I was passionate about, it was what I wanted to do, and um, it now has changed my life. Nice. Love it. That, that, was, that was beautifully said. From the bottom of my heart, I want you to have a joyous day. Okay? Thank you. I hope <laughs> you have an insane day. I will. I'll try. <laughs> Thank you, Ryan. I'll, I'll see you later. Bye-bye.
Ryan, nothing but respect for how seriously you took that. We were on the phone for seven minutes. He was thinking about what to say for seven minutes. That's, that's, I respect that. And for me, one of the main things that I learned from YouTube is that you shouldn't be afraid to just experiment with making different kinds of videos and don't try and make the perfect video, just keep on making videos. Because if you worry too much about trying to make the perfect video, you'll never, you'll never, you'll never get around to making that video. But through making a bunch of movies, you learn, you make those mistakes and then you learn. Um, and then you just have more fun because filmmaking is awesome. So that's one of the main things I learned and I think when it comes to my favorite experiences of 2017, uh, relating to YouTube. Uh, I loved being in Japan making my films there. I felt like I was really in my element sharing um, interesting stuff and also just so grateful to be a part of the YVR and connect with a bunch of young creators across the globe. So that's pretty awesome. So folks, thank you so much for watching. It's been a joy having you on this journey and I can't wait to see uh, what happens next in 2018. Here are the best moments of 2017. See ya. What's up, dearest wonderful people? 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 It's all over here. It's all over here. It's all over here. It's all over here. I made this sign. Ooh, hundred. And today we are doing a Q and A. My first Q and A ever. Well, I have a small stutter. A very small stutter. You guys for being awesome supporters. You guys are the most wonderful people and supporters that I could ever dream of. Peace out, respect your elders. Peace out, respect your elders. Have a euphoric rest of your day. Have a euphoric rest of your day. Have a euphoric rest of your day. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.